G'day guys, Champ Chong here with my new gaming setup video. Now, if you've noticed over the last few weeks, I've been changing things around and finally my brand new PC, which is an Omen X by HP PC, has arrived. So that is the centerpiece that brings it all together. And I am now going to show you guys my finished gaming setup video. I still haven't done all the cable management and stuff like that, but I will get to it. So hopefully you guys do end up enjoying this new gaming setup video. Please smack the like button if you do end up enjoying it and now let's get to it all right and here we are as you can see this is my gaming setup you guys see it in pretty much all my gaming news videos so it's behind me in the background all the time but we're going to take a really good look at it today so it starts with a pc on the left here we move all past this and we'll actually begin over here so this thing right here houses all my games cables and things like that that i just don't want on display but what i do want on display is this the NBA 2K ball that I recently got for 2K17? Looks awesome, it's display case. And you got Yoda up there looking like a G. And we move on to my microphone. This is probably one of my favorite things that I've recently got and upgraded to, just like my chair. But this thing right here is amazing. It's a Rode microphone, as you can see, it says Rode right there with a pop filter. And um, basically, I use this thing for all of my live streams and my like commentary, live videos, things like that. So, all gameplay related stuff. But the interesting thing about this is you've probably seen this, like a lot of YouTubers have this on the swivel arm and it can like move around and everything. I like move it out of the way and all that stuff. So that's cool. But the interesting thing is it runs off of a XLR cable and it runs all the way into this thing, which is a mixer, which I have no idea how to use, but I've somehow managed to set it up and it sounds fine. So there's that cable and then the USB cable runs into my computer. Moving on away from that stuff, you can see two controllers there. I'll skip past those because they're not that important right now. We move to this. As you can see, this is, oh wow. I can't even put it into words. If you don't know right now, these screens are 27 inches. These are HP Z27S screens. And these HP Z27S screens, what they are, are 4K screens. Yes, they are all 4K resolution. They are Ultra HD and they look amazing when playing games. Games like Doom, I played uh, Battle uh, Battlefield 1's beta on here. And I also had a go with uh, Tomb Raider on here, put it up all the way to Ultra. I definitely want to try more games. I just managed to, so I haven't really had a good turn with three screens yet. I've only just upgraded. So tell me some games in the comments down below as to which games I should play on triple screen. That, that, that'll be fun. Maybe make a video of it or something. I'm not sure. But what I am sure about is that I love using these screens. And uh, yeah, they are just amazing. But moving on, let's see this. This is my keyboard. It is an Omen X keyboard, and that is my mouse. Now, at first, I, I fell in love with this keyboard, and then I was like, oh, this mouse. Wait a second. Because for me, changing a mouse is a big deal. But when I changed the mouse, I actually found that I like this one more than my old mouse because it comes up a bit higher than a normal mouse. And for me, I have gigantic hands. Like, I have huge hands. And for me, it was just great to have that on there. So. That is my mouse and keyboard and they look sweet. Anyway, now to move on, you can see that's my Logitech uh, camera. I think it's a C920. I think every YouTuber and streamer has this camera unless they upgrade to an even higher one, but it's like the most generic webcam. I think I showed it in my last setup, but who cares about the camera right now? Because behind my screens here, with all this terrible cable management and stuff, you can see my Xbox One S console. And you can also see my PlayStation 4, which is not the slim model, but they're both white. Um, it just happened to be so that I, I got that one white and then the Xbox One S came out and was white. And I was like, sweet, they both look amazing right there because they're kind of out of sight, but they're really small. So you can't really see them unless you're like, ooh, I can see you. But, uh, oh, there's my Xbox One Elite controller. I love that thing. So that's what I play most of my games with. That's like a second controller really for display. And that's my main PS4 controller. To the main thing, and it's this beast right here. This, ladies and gentlemen, is my brand new PC and the specs are just ridiculous. I'm gonna put them in the comments, or not in the comments, in the description down below. The specs of my brand new Omen X by HP PC. And I wanna tell you guys something real quick is that HP actually provided me this PC and these screens, keyboard and mouse. They um, are actually my new PC sponsor, essentially. But yeah, now let's actually talk about my new PC. So as you can see, 
here we have the logo of the Omen PC and it says Omen right there too. And uh, you got all these lights and stuff, it matches the lights back there and it's re really cool. So on the side here, you have like some uh, super speed USBs right there. You have uh, some more USBs uh, and then you got an SD card reader and some stuff and there's the power button right there. But inside here is where it gets really interesting and I'll show you guys that in a second. But I'm not even sure if I should do this when it's turned on, but you can flip this up, whoop, I'm actually doing it, and take out the hard drives and like put a new hard drive in there and stuff, it's, it's really cool. But on this side, it gets really crazy and I'll show you guys that right now. All right, so here we go, I'm taking this off. There was a little button back here, but I've taken that off and now we're gonna actually take a look. Let's, let's put the side panel down and grab the camera really quickly and take a look on the inside right here. So, as you can see, there are two GTX 1080s. That is just beyond me. Like, that, that, that is ridiculous. Inside here, cable management, everything looks really, really nice in there. Uh, there are two free slots in there for an extra eight gigs of RAM and an extra eight gigs of RAM. So that'll give you an extra 16, pump it up to a uh, 32, which is on 16 right now. And you can also see the motherboard, everything here. It all just looks incredible in there. And taking that thing off the side panel feels like you're sort of, I guess, taking the hood off a car, like taking like and showing your range in. It's just a cool experience. So that is the inside. I know a lot of you guys would have liked to see a little closer look, but that's it. That's it right there. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this close up look. All right, and hopefully you guys enjoyed an inside look of my new PC. Has the two 1080s in there, SLI. It is just a ridiculous machine. I can't wait to upgrade it to uh, 32 gigs of RAM. That It's just gonna be like the best PC ever. So yeah, well, the best PC I've ever had. So mm, uh, this is my baby. Anyway, so that is my setup, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Check it out. It, yeah, I'm really proud of it. And uh, thank you to HP for setting this up. This is just freaking awesome and I do get to keep everything, so woo! And there we have it guys, uh, that is my gaming setup video. It is a completely new updated setup video, very different from my last one, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that. And if you did, please smack that like button. I'm really proud of it, it looks amazing. I added those LED lights, got the PC, three screens, Xbox, PlayStation, got the new mic, all that stuff you saw in the video. I'm really proud of this setup and it's all thanks to you guys. And I just wanna say, finally, before this video ends, thank you to everyone that watches my videos, supports, subscribes, everything, because without you guys, I wouldn't be able to have an amazing setup like this or travel the world, go to gaming events. With your support, all this is possible, so thank you. From, from me, I just wanna say thank you. Alan, not champ, or I guess I am champ, but Alan says, Thank you to everyone that is subscribed to my videos. Without you guys, none of this would be possible. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this one and hopefully enjoy the many more to come.